Okay, so good morning class or good morning students. So by the way, I am Vicente Kisay Jr. I'm your um, tutor for today. So before we're going to start, let us uh, stand up and then uh, let us pray. Let us pray. Gwen, um, can you please um, lead the prayer? Classmates, let us pray. In the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father in heaven, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Do not bring us to the test, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Okay? Okay, so before tamo start, i-arrange sa inyong mga bangko and then basing na yung mga hugaw sa inyong mga kilit-kilit. You can make koan. Uh, picked all of that. Okay, so I, I think you, we are all now set. So, ang, akong i-tutor ninyo ron is about singular and plural. So, yun sa'yo na idea o uh, unsa ng singular? Koan. Kanang singular usaha. Okay, so singular is usa. How about plural? Daghan. Okay, so it is denoting one or uh, two or more as object or things. Okay, so the nouns you use in uh, in a sentence is koan kanang kinahanglan yun. So karon uh, before tamo continue, um, just give me um, some example or before we we are going to continue the thing that I will chat uh, tutor to you. Um, can you please introduce yourself first and then I want you to stand up when you are introducing yourself, please. Yes, let's start to you, Gwen. Introduce yourself. I am Cassandra Jane K. Hilardes, 14 years old and grade 9. Okay, thank you. Next. I'm Rosemary Kimon Harris. <laughs> What grade are you? Ten. Grade, grade? Four. Grade four. Okay, thank you. Next, please. I'm Christina Valheroy. I'm 14. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 14. 14. What's your grade name? 15 years old. I'm grade 10. Okay, so 15 years old, grade 10. Okay, so um, who can give me an um, example of a singular word? Uh, singular word, ra. Sige, example. Sige, sige, go. Child. Child, okay. How about ang um, plural ano niya is? Children. Children. Adult. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, ug child, uh, ug singular, usarag yun na siya. So, ug may kang usara, usarag yun, wak na gula yung kauban. So, ang um, plural po, two or more na siya. So, pananglitan, ug mingon kong man, unsa na siya, singular or plural? Plural. Singular. Singular, correct. Ang ang plural men. ana is men. Men, okay. Pag may kong woman, singular plural. Singular. singular. Sure? Yes. Okay, very good. So ang plural ana is woman. Woman, okay, very good. Pag uh, mo ingon ko nga uh, banana. Singular. Singular, very good. So ang singular is usara. Uh, ako i-repeat. Ang singular is usara and then ang plural is duha. Okay. So ug mayong kung b, kung say plural ana niya, kanang buyog ba buyog? B. B is very good. Ang fox? Foxes. Very good. Ang patch? Patches. Very good. Ang child? Children. Very good. Kusgan kayo. Oy, kay kaganina natubag naman. Okay. Ang mouse. Mice. Hmm? Mice. Mice. Very good. Ang goose. G. G. Kaya na mo. Goose. Ang sa ang goose? Goose. Goose. Mara siya ang duckling ba? Geese. Very good. Geese. Okay. Pag, um... Mingan ko sa sentence nga, I see two books. Anong books? Ano sana siya? Plural. Plural. Very good. So, nakoy ko anin nyo ha? Kanang, nakoy pas ko anin nyo. Um, I-question ninyo din. I-try ninyo o gamon nga plural form. Okay. Ang atong i-plural ani is ang goose. Ha? So, paminawa akong sentence. 
were wearing bills and bows. Goose were wearing bills and bows. Ang kinanglang i-plural ani is ang goose. Geese. Oh, sige, unsa na? Geese. 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 Okay, so um again akong usbon, ang question number one is Goose were wearing bills and bows. Sige, um Gwen, Cassandra, uh, answer this one. Goose were wearing bills and bows. Ang kinanglan ni mong imuong plural form is ang goose. Geese were wearing bells and bows. Very good. Okay, so how about um Christine Ava? Uh, ang kinanglan ni mong i plural form is ang road ay ang man. So, road on an elephant. Man road an elephant. Very good. Ah, uh, ikaw na pod Gwen. Ah, uh, woman ang kinahanglang i sana i, i plural form. Okay. So sample is uh, the, ang sentence is ah uh, woman rode horses. Women rode horses. Very good. Na abay ma change ani sa horses wala. Wala. Wala ra. Very good. Okay, next Ava. Ah uh, clown. Ang clown na pod ha. Moy kinahanglang i plural. Uh, clown carried large balloons. Clowns carried large balloons. Very good. Uh, band na po, kisan, uh, Gwen. Band played loud music. Bands played loud music. Very good. I-pronounce ganyan yung minayo ang last letter kaya parang mga kuha na, parang si Imong Giingon nga. Bands. Kinang lang ang, ang pinaka ulay ang letter mga kuha na gunin nyo para ma-identify o asa ang plural. Next. Um, Ava, uh, when a uh, child ang kinahanglang i plural form, child went to a parade. Children's went to a parade. Children's ba na siya or children? Children. Children, very good. Okay. Kay, ug mahimo na yung children's, ug i children's na siya, malahi na po ang, ang sentence. Okay. One Kla, uh, okay, ang sunod ani is peach. Atong, kuan ba? Kaning? Frutas. Frutas. Okay. Peach one clown handed out. Gwen. Peaches one handed clown. <laughs> Balik tan. <laughs> uh, peach one clown handed out. Peaches. One clown. One hand clown handed out. Very good. Okay, next. Um, Cassandra, flowers. Ay, unsa ni ka ng Ava? Uh, flower. A car. A uh, flower. A car was covered with. Ano, ano na? Flower ang kinanglan ha. So, sa last sentence, napunta sa last word. A car was covered with flower. A ang car. flower mo ay kuan, i plural. A car. A car was covered. A car was covered with, with a flowers. With flowers, with flowers. Okay, very good. Okay, so. Okay, medyo kabalo naman po mo. mo. Question, question na lang ko ninyo. Ang eye. Ang sayi, kuha na ng eye. Eyes. Eyes, very good. Ang plural. Um, ang sayi, ganito. O singular pila ka buo? One. Oh, ikaw, ikaw, Marie. Um, ang, ang plural pila ka buo? Daghan. Doha or? Daghan. Okay, so, mura na, diha na takutog kay murag kay kabalo naman mo. Mubalik na taog mga kay parang tuturan na punta mong lain nga um, lesson. So, pag andam mo tomorrow kay mag-exam ta para ano nga singular and plural or. Okay, so, thank you kaayos sa inyong pag-ari, pag-spend sa inyong time, sa pag- uh, sa inyong pag-prepare, uh, then just prepare for an exam tomorrow, okay? Yes. Okay. So, that's all and then thank you. Salamat!